So everyone has a different idea of what their ideal, I guess, self-care acts would be. So say do, having a bath is an act of self-care for a lot of people, but for a lot of other people, people find baths very stressful, they get sweaty and they don't find it relaxing at all. Having knowledge of a wide variety of different self-care things to do is a great way to try them out, see what works for you and see what doesn't work for you so you know for the future what you need to do when you need to give yourself some self-care. Doing some exercise, no matter what sort of kind it is. Cleaning your room or your space. Cooking or baking. Calling a friend or a family or just talking to them in person. Having a bath with a nice fun bath bomb if you want. Stretching or using a roller. Getting a good night's sleep. Getting into nature. Watching the sunset and sunrise. Having a tea or a coffee. Turning off your phone or just having a day off social media. Decluttering your social media or decluttering a space of your environment that stresses you out. So that could be, say, your clothes, your makeup, your kitchen, your electronics, anything like that. Clearing out your email inbox, drinking lots of water, snuggling or cuddling with your friend, partner, brother, sister, mum, dad, anyone, or even your pet. Lighting a candle, doing a face mask, playing with makeup or doing your nails. You can read a book or a magazine. You could meditate, do some gratitude. You can listen to a podcast, audiobook or music, or you can even dance to that music if you want. You can see my nice cringy dancing here. <laughs> you can draw, you can do some journaling. If you want to do some extra self-love, you can write a love letter to yourself. You can watch your favorite movie, watch a documentary, and buy yourself some flowers. There are many, many more things, but hopefully you found at least one thing in this list that will, that will be a future self-care act for you. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video. My most recent self-care video was how I integrate self-care into my everyday life. So I'll link that at the end of this video and down below. And also a bunch of other videos where I got a bunch of these clips from. So I'll link that all down below. So you've got plenty of material to watch for mine if you wanted to. And hopefully you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.